Yeah, hey, no Drake Slender, man. No Drake Slender at all would be tolerated. But anyway, what is good, YouTube? It's your boy Cameron K with the whips in the back. Back with a video for you guys today. Back with a banger on this channel. We're on the road to half of me. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, man. You feel me? First stop as the police come by while my car's tinting. Look like they're trying to turn around. First stop, bro. The car is, I ain't gonna lie. The car is dirty, bro. It is a lot of pollen out these days. It is springtime, right? It's getting towards the springtime, right? If I got the season wrong, my bad, but I never cared about nothing but sum summer because then we got out of school. Come on now. Everybody know that. And then winter. That's because we got Christmas. You know what I'm saying? Christmas came around. But then I ain't care about nothing else if I'm being real with you. I don't know what, what autumn is. I know the leaves fall, but I don't know around what time. Uh, in spring, I think. But I think spring with the pollen. But anyway, like I said, bro. <laughs> Yeah, that just still sound good. Let me get out here and spray this whip off, bro, because she deserves it. She do deserve it. Look at that. And I'm allergic to pollen, too. So that's the bad part. That joint is dirty. Look, I ain't going to touch it because I'm allergic to it, like I said. I'll be out here sneezing on the video. Y'all wouldn't even be able to hear me. No cap. But, yeah, man, let's... Let's... <clears throat> to get some water on it. Just I watched it last time. You feel me? So they gonna get that going, Cam fan. Hey, Cam fan, how y'all day? But what y'all got going on, man? I want to put y'all on the paint. Put y'all on the wrap. What y'all got going on, Cam fan? Yeah, Cam fan. Yeah, the stuff I own is every video these days. I'm on the, um, putting that stuff on spree. You can come right out, man. If I lose, uh, she might choke. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's the golden eye. That's the golden eye can fam. Not the red eye. That's the golden one. The golden tail. Come right off, bro. Right off. And then we're gonna let that turn air dry. That's all we need, no cap. That's all we need, can fam. That's simple. Now I'm finna pull that joint out. Then when I pull that joint out, I'm gonna bag it up first. I'm gonna put y'all right here, can fam. Now we just gotta let that jump dry off, bro. Then we're good. That's eco mode too. That is not. That is not Demon 170 mode. That is not the Angel mode. That's great eco. I'm 700, 800 horsepower when eco mode. Some slight. There we go. Like I said, if you dry this jump a little fast. Well, I really can't dry fast because my dread radio is wet and they already not. Screed tires, so it ain't recommended, but y'all know Camel can do what he want. So it's been dry that junk like it is recommended. Do you feel me? Mm. Yeah, man. Hey, Cam fan, how y'all feel about the demon in the vet mansion? I think it's fire, no cap. No cap. Go follow my own um, page. We almost had 10,000 followers, two Camel Whips. Y'all be going crazy over there liking them pictures too. Three of them got like 7,000, 4,000, 3,000, 5,000 just on the car. So y'all really love this Demon 170, bro. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all for, huh, for that cam, fam. Now, the question is what we eat, bro. What do we eat, cam, fam? Do I go left or right right now? I'm trying to see what I want to eat. What kind of mood, man, do we go, bro? What I want. I'm gonna tell y'all back up when I figure out what I want, bro, because right now I don't know. All right, Cam fam, so your boy got. You feel me? I can't eat inside because you know I got a Mopar. When you a Mopar owner, you can't eat inside. That's insane, bro. Six feet of car and I can't eat inside because they'll come steal it. <laughs> Cam fam, that's insane, bro. Like, that's insane. I'm gonna drop my camera, bro. Six feet of car, bro. And can't even eat inside and enjoy it because. 
I might come outside and they're trying to be gone. Like, it's crazy to me. Hey, we can't eat in the restaurant like every other, every other YouTuber, right? Because y'all know every other YouTuber. Well, some of them get them up on. Every other YouTuber be, um, you feel me, chilling and chilling and relaxing and eating. But yeah, Cam fam, like I said, what y'all give them Subway, bro? I just went a little um, ham and cheese, lettuce, jalapenos, you know what I'm saying? A little stuff like that. Something slight, get the first bite before I even do the what's the name. Fire, bro. Make sure y'all some questions on my Instagram, Q&A, on um, Camel Cat. Go um, follow me on there if y'all want to be featured in the next Q&A. I do eat just like once every two months. That boy said, demon rap hard, no cap. No cap, man. That boy said, demon rap hard, no cap. Appreciate it, twin. Is your insurance high on, on the cars? Bro. Insurance is stupid high, bro. Over a thousand. My insurances are car notes. Right. Like thousands of dollars can fam. Like, hold up, a Jeep pulling up beside me with some tent. I gotta stay on my game, bro. I gotta I get, not get caught lagging. I gotta make sure we good. All right, we good here, other dude. We here, can fam. If you get a hell at 18, 19, 21, whatever your payment is, just assume that's what your insurance is gonna be, bro. <laughs> 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 if your payment twelve hundred, you're gonna sure it might be about nine hundred. You see what I'm saying? So add that into the fact too. Add that to the fact too, can fam. That whatever your payment is, your insurance is gonna be there too. Like almost that, if not more. It just depends on how many wrecks you get, how many T's you get. If you're young, it's already gonna be high, bro. Like I said, I really got some good um some good history. I ain't got no tickets, really, since I've been over 18. Shout out to God. Shout out to me for being responsible. But yeah. I ain't got no real tickets since I've been over 18, can fam, so. My insurance should be low, but for this six-figure dollars and how much money I'm gonna ask for my insurance back, it gotta be high. I ain't gonna cap, so. It is what it is. I think my cheapest insurance was like on my Hellcat when I got it. When I was 19, 18, it was like 600. Y'all know these demons insurance be higher for sure. But yeah, when you gonna modify the vet? Hey man, look. Look Cam fam. I ain't gonna modify the vet like y'all was saying twin turbo and um stuff like that. Twin, I ain't trying to have, like, that vet is a daily driver car, bro. Like, just something to get in, some some real reliable, some chill, but at the same time, exotic, right? I'm not trying to have a a loud, fast Corvette, if that makes sense. Like, that just something that I can get in and be chill and low-key. Low like, I already got a Dodge Demon and Demon 170, bro. These just loud and exotic. I said loud and exotic. <laughs> These cars right here are loud. They're targeted by the police. They're targeted by random niggas. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get some strikers and sell them for the low. So I got to deal with all that when I'm in the SRT, bro. I don't feel like dealing with all that when I'm in my vet. Like, the vet just supposed to be chill, low-key. I can go to the mall, go shopping. You feel me? Go on a date in it. Just do, just do everyday life stuff and still be fly at the same time, if that makes sense. Like, I think the vet, I love the CA vet, I ain't gonna lie. It's like a, <laughs> it's something like a Ferrari, bro, if I'm being real with you. It's like a, a affordable, affordable $100,000, right? <laughs> About seven, eighty thousand dollars $80,000, so affordable quotation marks, depends on where you work at, right? It's like an affordable um, supercar. That's why I like the vet. 
Would you get a cyber truck? Would I get a cyber truck? Uh, nah. Them look like 150 bands, ain't it? Mm-mm. Nah, I, I wouldn't get no cyber truck twin. I don't got no problem with it. They fire. They different. They futuristic. But I don't. I really have a TRX. I might be tripping. Y'all might be like, come okay, you just such such such. But I really have a TRX, but I ain't gonna count. I think TRX is just like uh, the goat pickup truck to me. I like the Raptors too. I ain't gonna lie to four Raptors. I like them too. But for 150 bands, I'd rather take 80 bands or 90 bands, which I still don't wanna do, right? And go and buy a TRX. But I don't wanna do that because TRX don't go number like 120. But I mean, my Demon 170 don't go number 149, huh? So it's about the same thing, huh? But yeah, bro, I wouldn't even buy no TRX. I'm just saying if I had the option to choose. Now, if you was giving me one, I might think about it. I might, I might just take a, a Cybertruck. If it was a gift from like somebody to give to me, that I think about that, I ain't gonna lie. If I could choose a Cybertruck or a TRX, I'd be like, dang, which one I'm gonna go with? But if I'm going to the car lot, I'm going TRX all day. I'm just, just be real with you, bro. The screech, the screech know what I'm saying. Favorite whip. What you mean by favorite whip, twin? Like right now or all time? I mean, it's probably the same one anyway, right? My favorite whip right now, end of all time, is my, it's, it's the Demon 170, it's the car man right now. Yeah, I know how much I love my um OG demon, my 2018 demon, right? When I got when I got that, but this car right here, bro, is 170. It's so much more better and so much more enhanced, and so much more detailed. Like it just so much more responsive, bro. I drove my demon yesterday to get something to eat, right? And it was cool, it was fast. But it's like when I get in here, bro, it's like I'm in a, a um, electric car, bro, because it's like so much more responsive, bro. I burn tap the gas and I'm jerking back. That demon never gave me that feeling. And I thought that car was crazy when I had it all this time. But a, a stock car like this, just leaving the car lots, it's insane, Cam fam. I ain't gonna lie. When you coming to Miami, I don't got nothing to do in Miami, bro. I don't, only time I went to Miami was for spring break. I was gonna go this year with AB and them, but some came up and I had stuff to do and I had, you know what I'm saying, business to take care of. But I probably only go to Miami for spring breaks, bro. Cause there's a lot of cars out there, a lot of content. It's just where everybody be at, you know what I'm saying? But as far as just like, I wanna go to Miami. I don't think I wanna do that. Uh, why you don't get a C7Z06? Mm, I just ain't get, I just ain't get around to it, bro. Like. I would for sure take one, cause I love C7s and I love Z06s, right? It'll probably be one of my favorite cars if I get one, because if y'all don't know, my Z01 is my favorite car, right? And I love the looks and the aesthetics of the Corvette, the cosmetics of it. And then it's actually like more, you know, you can drive it faster around curves and all that. It's like a way faster track car. It's like everything a uh, Hellcat is, red eye, but it actually can go around curves, so it's a funner car. You can actually feel like G-force in your stomach and like, you know what I'm saying? You get more thrills because you can drive fast around curves. So I might love a C7 Z06, not, lie, not gonna lie, but I don't see myself getting one no time soon, if I'm being real with you. I'm done buying cars for a minute, I think. You should go Nardo Blue and Black on your Demon. Uh, is Nardo Blue like Indigo Blue? I'm not familiar with your um with your game. <laughs> That's the meme everybody was saying. My bad, I wasn't familiar with your game. <laughs> but now nah, I gotta look up that color twin. I'm I might. But I don't really wanna change the blue. I like the blue on my demon right now. If I was gonna do anything, I'm gonna tell y'all a little secret. I would just match the demon, the twenty eighteen demon with the demon one seventy. The blue on that, the blue on the Corvette. If I'm doing anything to it. Race the C eight and demon yet is no it's no use, swim. Sell the vet and get a track. Like I said, bro, I love checkouts. I love them. But the only problem is, bro, I have all Mopars, bro. I just told y'all what's, what's wrong with Mopars, bro. You can't, you can't go shopping in them, bro. Like, I can't, go, I can't go in the mall 
for three hours without thinking about my car getting stolen and checking my app and having to go to the car lot to make sure the car's still there. You know what I'm saying? Like, twin in the vet, I'm chilling. The worst a nigga can do is break in. They already did that. It's cool. It's a video and I get my window fixed. It's cool. But a track, bro, if I come outside with my $100,000 track off missing, I'm going to be, I'm going to be, I'm going to be mad. I ain't going to count. A lot of y'all be like, you can get insurance on it. It ain't about insurance, bro. That makes your insurance higher for no reason. I'm already paying high insurance. See what I'm saying? Like, I'm losing, losing. For what? Like, I get my car stolen. Yes, I, I get my money back, and I make a little money. But now my insurance is $1,500, bro, 2000 It didn't win a $400 for something I ain't do because I'm trying to go in the mall. I ain't got time, bro. I ain't got time, Cam, bro. How do you get good credit? Man, first you want to get a job, right? Get you a little job. Then you want to go to a credit union or anywhere and get you a credit card. Or ask your bank for a credit card once you open up a um, bank account. A lot of y'all don't be having bank accounts, bro. Like, it's crazy. We in 2024, y'all still ain't got bank accounts. But go get a bank account, bro. You know what I'm saying? Open up your bank account. Then try to get you a little credit card. Once you get a credit card, start paying for everything on it, like gas. You know what I'm saying? Gas. You might go shopping, get some shoes, you might get some clothes. But don't spend over like 30% of your credit card. So if your credit card limit is $1,000, don't spend over $300. If your credit card limit is $10,000, don't spend over, what's 30% of 10000 Don't spend over $3,000. You see what I'm saying? So whatever your limit is, don't spend over 30% of it and pay it back every month for like a year straight. And then, Save up you some money. Go get you a RT, Hemi, a Hellcat, or whatever you want. And then don't miss payments, twin. In like three years, your credit will be crazy. Really two years, but three at the tops. So by the time you turn, let's say you 17, 18 right now. By the time you turn 21, your credit good for life. Just don't mess it up. That's all you got to do. It's that simple. What you think about getting a, another GT500? Yeah, bro, I ain't going to lie. I love that car. I ain't going to care. Like, if y'all watch my channel... Y'all know I hate Mustangs, bro. But I can't cap. I love that G500. But would I get another one? In the future, bro. Not right now. I got to be real rich to get another one. Because like I said, I'm so hell okay that I done checked out, check out and stuff out, bro. I'm not going to, to another um, G500 stuff. Nigga, is you scamming? How am I scamming, twin? What you mean by that? Am I scamming? What you mean? What you, why you asking? Am I scamming for? <laughs> why? Why I'm scamming, twin? What you mean by that? I ain't gonna answer that question because it's like, what you even talking about, twin? You going to Rick Ross Car Show for sure? Thoughts on my kid going to jail? I ain't gonna lie, bro. What y'all don't know is, bro. Me and my kid talked a lot. A lot, a lot. Off the phone, bro. Like, me and my kid used to talk for like two, three hours, bro. Like at one o'clock in the morning. Just about everything, bro. Like, just chatting it up. They were like my little brother, bro. Like, I know my kid since he was like 16, I think. Yeah, since he was 16, bro. And when I first met him in um, BR. And they were like my little brother ever since then, bro. I ain't gonna cap. I always try to, like, Tell them, come out here today, come drive these cars, come link up, because every time I get a new car, that was the first nigga calling me, bro. I ain't going to lie. Every time I got a new car, bro. Even when I got my Demon 170. He be like, damn, bro, that's your hard, bro. I'm, trying, bro. I'm watching your video, Cam. That's your hard, twin. I'm coming to the A, bro. We got to, you know what I'm saying? We got to do that. I got to drive it, bro. Let me drive it. I would never let him drive my junks, though, bro. Then I finally let my kid drive my demon, like, what, four, five months ago. Then my ain't get the burning that junk out, can't fam. Get the scrape burning that junk out. That was not part of the plan. I told this nigga, my kid, do not burn my car out, bro. All right, come okay, give me the keys. I'm like, twin, please, this is a six-figure car, twin, that's rare. Don't burn my car out, my kid. Please don't rate that junk. Give him the key, we do the video, all right? We end up chilling. We could do a stop sign. This man get to slide in that junk. I ain't gonna lie. He can drive though, okay, fam. My kid can drive. Can drive. He know how to drop the gears and everything. He he probably one of the best YouTubers to drive my car. If I'm being real, which I think he is the best. He the youngest. That's crazy. But he be sliding, but he always go to like events and slide cars. That's what he do. He been doing that since he was 16.
So he probably, what, two, three years in now? He should have been just live. But yeah, but my kid was a real nigga. But like my little brother, like I said, he always supported me. Every time he was finna go car shopping, every time he finna get a car, he always called me, Cam, what you think about this car? Is this a good car? Is this a good car? I'm like, yeah, bro. Like, that's your heart. But yeah, bro. Free my kid, bro. Like I said, he's my little brother. I hate to see him in them, in them circumstances, bro. Because he's like a a young good dude, but I ain't gonna lie. He a uh, straight, straight young real nigga, bro. And when he came to Atlanta, he always stayed in my house. When I, you know what I'm saying? When he came. That's what I don't know either. Like, my kid was staying in my house, bro. Like, uh, like a good, what, four, five days. Him and uh, Hefe. Shout out Hefe, bro. Hefe, hit me up, bro. I need to talk to you to make sure everything good on y'all end. But, um, yeah, bro. And my little brother, bro. I ain't gonna cap that. I look he shared a chill last night for that nigga, bro. If I'm being real with y'all, bro. Speaking of niggas, when you and Josh gonna collab again? I don't know, bro. We might run to each other at, uh, you know what I'm saying, the future at an event, or he might be in the A, come to an event. You never know, bro. Never know. I think that's pretty much it. Advice for YouTuber with 2K subscribers. Posting, bro. Grinding. Showing your face. Like, this. I'm going to answer this and I'm going to be done. Just in 20 minutes. But, yeah, like I was saying, bro. If you're a new YouTuber and you're a car YouTuber, it's hard out here, bro. Because it's, so it's so many niggas copying. And, like, you got me with the demons. You got corn with the McLarens and Lambs. You got Lynn with the cats. You got people with tracks. Like, Every car is copped. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Like, every car you can cop is copped. <laughs> it can't get more copy. You feel me? Just Atlanta alone, bro. Atlanta niggas alone done copped every car and vlogged every car and popped this stuff so long. So it's like, when you get a car these days, it's like, back in the day when I got my Hellcat, bro, I was the first nigga to get a Hellcat on YouTube. Let's make that clear. The first young nigga, like, let's make that clear, bro. But, because y'all be forgetting sometimes, but that buying a Hellcat at 18... <laughs> Your boy Camel can start there, but I ain't gonna talk about that though. But anyway, um, uh, had to see my little tea. I had, I gotta pop it sometime, Cam fam. I don't never do it, bro. I just wanna get myself some flowers. Can I get myself? Some, can I get myself some flowers, Cam fam? But yeah, like I was saying, bro, it's so many niggas getting money and winning these days. It's like, dang, bro. Like, ain't nothing. It's, it's like when you got a haircut and you 19 and you pull up these days, people think that's regular. That's insane, bro. Buying a eighty thousand dollars, seventy thousand dollars Hellcat at eighteen, and pulling up to the mall, niggas don't even care no more. They be like, oh yeah, he get money. You know what I'm saying? He just can't. They just say anything and walk off. Back in the day, bro, when I had my cat at eighteen, nineteen, and I was flying through the city, but people seen me. How old you is? Eighteen. You got a Hellcat? What you doing? You scam? I want to. I ain't scamming. Scamming wasn't even that popular back then. But niggas still be like, you scamming, bro? What you doing? Put me on. I'm like, twin. I just hustle, bro. I just, I just hustling and got lucky. Simple. <laughs> you feel me? I'm gonna be real. I just hustling and got lucky, bro. But I don't call it luck because I'm a hustler, but yeah. But now these days, bro, you pull up in a cat, you 18, you put it on YouTube, nigga be like, why you ain't get a red eye? Like, twin, what? Yeah, what? So I just spent 67000 on the Hellcat. You said, why I ain't get no red eye for 82000 Twin, I'm 18, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's your high idea these day, Cam fam. It's getting harder and harder, bro. But I like it. That means people getting money. A lot of people winning. That mean our expectation is getting higher. So it's really a good thing if you think about it because it's like, it's like these day. hey, back in the day we was like, dang, he getting money. These days it's like everybody getting money. You know what I'm saying? So it's really a good thing if you think about it. But but just stay consistent, bro. Stay grinding. Keep posting. You never know when your day going to come up. You never know what opportunity going to change your life. I always be available for the opportunity, and whenever you at an event or some, just try to make yourself stand out, bro. Make people, you know what I'm saying, follow you or remember you. Like with me, when I was had 2,000 subscribers, I was pulling up to events, but I was in that Mamba Hellcat. And I was a young, I was a young nigga. So everybody was like, this nigga in a Hellcat with a Kobe Bryant rap, that's your heart. It just make you remember me. That's why I be like, when I see you, I'm like, if I seen a big YouTube back in the day, I'm like, you don't remember me? I had the Kobe Hellcat. Oh, yeah, that was your heart. You see what I'm saying? Like, just make yourself more known, bro. Or just go buy you a demon. It's only one of them. Only me already doing it. <laughs>